What's up? Welcome in my kitchen. Today I'm gonna show you how to make nice Italian pasta with some tomatoes and prawns inside. So, what do we need? We need a pan, very hot pan, with a little bit of oil. Just a touch of oil on this pan. And next, the garlic. The garlic goes first. Italian love to put the garlic first because uh, it gives you unbelievable taste to the pasta. Okay, so when the garlic is uh, ready, nice finely chopped, we put it straight in the hot pan and then prawns. Remember to clean the prawns from the, uh, from the side because otherwise you're going to eat shit. To kind of toast it on the pan, and in the same time, I'm gonna chop the tomatoes very finely. Okay, now when the tomatoes are ready, adding them to the prawn. Mm. They smell so good straight away, and we need to kind of cook them together to make a nice tomato sauce and I'm also gonna add some white wine it's Italian wine but you need to try first if it's good because if it's good your dish is gonna be fantastic but if it's shit your pasta is gonna be shit so let's try it first nice smell nice aroma mm. okay you don't need a lot just uh, about that much and just cook it together for about a couple of minutes. When everything is cooking together and the sauce looks fantastic, we just add a big spoon of the butter, let it melt it to, straight into the sauce, and just add a little bit of salt. Here we are, not too much. And also, I'm gonna add about two teaspoons of tomato puree. Tomato puree is gonna fake the sauce a little bit and give, give the right flavor into the pasta here we are maybe a little bit more and now we're just cooking until the sauce is nice and thick beautiful mm. when the sauce is reduced a little bit more here we are we add the pasta. You can add also spaghetti, linguine. Linguine go well nice with seafood. But, well, I like the short pasta, like penne or this one, what I've got in here. And then, freshly grounded black pepper. Mm. That's it. And just uh, kind of, re we need to just reduce a little bit more. And the reason why I add the pasta now, I don't have a... I don't have a pasta boiler. If you've got one in the home, you can use it straight away. But I haven't got one, so uh, I need to heat up the pasta with the sauce and the prawns in the pan. And just one minute and everything is going to be ready. Here we are. Our pasta is nice and hot and looks so good. The sauce is all over it. And that's it. That's that's about for two people. But you know what? Just in the end, I'm gonna add some extra virgin olive oil, which gives the fantastic flavor. I would add also the parsley, fresh, nice and chopped, if I would have some. But I haven't got it, so uh, that's it. Also, you can serve it with cheese, nice grana padano, and that's it. Thank you so much for watching, and uh, if you like it, super subscribe my channel. See you later.